Hello everyone, my name is Web Weaver, and welcome to World of Horror. So listen, I gotta be honest right off the bat, I attended a party today. One might say I attended a social gathering. And like, listen, the banter engine was running overtime for like two and a half hours. And it's like, that's crazy. So the banter engine is running... Right, like, I, I don't know if we decided that some sort of, like, you know, if, if it was possible for the banter engine to run dry, necessarily, but, you know, uh, I'm just telling you, like, I'm, I'm, like, just chilling, alright? We're just hanging out, we're gonna just take it nice and easy, you know? We're just gonna, what in the goddamn, nice and easy? Uh, I'm trying to remember the full Benny quote, but it's escaping me at the moment. Does that mean that I need to play Fallout New Vegas again? Absolutely not. <laughs> I think we're- I think we're good on Fallout New Vegas, at least for quite a while. Cause I mean, I already did like a lot of crazy stuff in that game, like did all the DLC blind. I hadn't done that before. Well, I mean, it kind of makes sense with DLC doing it blind. I guess you could say. But yeah, no, we're, we're just hanging out, we're just chilling. I do, there is like a, a time, there is a time element to this, like my phone uh, falling off the, uh, the desk as is its want. That's okay. It's completely fine. Now, I'm, I, I have Miku selected, but I'm gonna be honest with you, we're probably going to we're probably going to play... Eh, let's play Miku, why not? And then we'll do... Uh, probably... Like, we've, we've been doing a lot of night errantry, errantry lately. Let's keep that train going. It's the night of the riot. And that can, that can be taken in multiple ways. I have immediately figured that out, like, right after I said it. It's like you know, things that uh, potentially aged poorly. I don't know. Look out the window and tell me if it aged poorly or not. Uh, if it's the night, of course. I mean, there, there could just be a, like a, a knight, like a fully clad armor knight outside uh, your window right now that is somehow affiliated with Riot Games. But uh, yeah, anyways, what are we doing? You know what? You know what's messed up? I was trying to think of like, what kind of League of Legends character would you describe as a knight? And then I was gonna say their name, but all I'm thinking about is stuff like Dragon Knight, Sven, and uh, what's his name from Dota. Like I actually can't think of like a traditional knight character from League of Legends. Like Garen? Yeah, I guess Garen, but I don't really think of Garen as a knight because he's a king. Right? Can kings be knights? I don't know. We're going into to a semantic argument here that I'm a little I'm a little frightened of. But like I I like I I thought of Garen, but I was like, is Garen a knight? Like I mean, he's like a king, right? He's like the king of Demacia. But uh, anyways, what are we talking about? What are we doing? Old League of Legends champion design went hard. Okay, I I'll say it. The new the new champion design is all right, and clearly. They've got uh, a lot of talent behind it, but there's just something like really nice about the older, the older League of Legends champions. I they they've all got some sort of like style to them. That the right like League of Legends used to have like this very scuffed art style that you could see still being alive in some of the splash arts, and then it got kind of updated into something a lot more modern. Which is, you know, objectively better. But I do miss the scuffed aspect of it. Like, there's, there was a lot of scuffed stuff about League of Legends. Because at one point, you know, Riot was like an indie game company. Right? Like, I, I think that's something that a lot of people probably, uh, for gore. Uh, along with Light Source, Takashi, Knowledge, Strength, Dexterity, and Charisma. Well, there is no seconds. Thank God for that. 
But yeah, like I remember, didn't they have to do something like with the with the first versions of League of Legends where they went to like a bowling alley and then if you were at the bowling alley you could play the beta version or like the alpha version of League or something? Like I, I remember vaguely something like that. And honestly, I think that's pretty legit. I, I think that's pretty cool. Now, of course, Riot Games has used that, like, small indie company status to uh, get away with a lot of stuff over the years. But, uh, yeah, no, I, I, I respect the hustle if you're going to a bowling alley to get people to, uh, to play your video game. But, uh, anyways, the inspiring novel, are we gonna use it? Probably. Without access to the little devil outfit, Skeleton Vomit is the objectively best, uh outfit. Now let us see Moriko just in case. Um, but you know, we were having a, a conversation on the Discord earlier about uh, custom events, because there are custom events that I've literally never seen in this game. We've seen all of Miku's custom events, but did you know there's a Kairi event we've never seen? Uh, and we have seen Moriko's custom event uh, a couple of times, but I don't remember seeing it very often. There's also the semi-auto Haru event, which if we ever see that, I gotta make semi-auto the run, right? Like, I, I gotta try that because I've never gotten to really do a run with that weapon yet. Uh, and it's only in that one specific location. Alright, this is hell, by the way. Um, but then there's also another Haru event, and there's a Mimi event we haven't seen either. There's a Mimi event where you go surfing, and you get plus two reason, plus four percent doom. And it's like, I've never even seen this stuff, and you're telling me these are options? Like, Aiko has a uh, an event called Distance, where you can recruit Aiko's friend, or you can lie to them, but every everything about that uh, doesn't work properly. So it doesn't matter what you choose, because if e even if you fail, there's no penalty for failing. And even if you succeed and you get Aiko's friend as an ally, she doesn't do anything. It's just so weird. It's just so scuffed. Anyways, we can get Bulletin A, we can get Police Raid, we can probably not get Coma. Uh, I'm gonna skip this, and okay, we're okay, so we're gonna go uh, TV Terror into Fear Festival, most likely. Because we don't have to worry about killing the uh, the cultist or anything like that. We can just uh, deal with it on our own time. Now, I would, I would very much appreciate a flashlight that it could be considered heavier than your average. Thank you very much. And, uh, yeah, I guess we'll we'll start the... Not necessarily shmovement now. I don't have the energy for shmovement. Are you kidding me? Well, I mean, it's drip, so we might as well. You know what would be kind of silly, but kind of fun? Like, uh... I'll do it 20%, that's fine. Get a stat increase, makes the game easier. It would be kind of fun to do, like, a, a world of horror, just as, like, a joke, right? Not as, like, a serious thing. But, like, a world of horror glamour contest, for lack of a better word, where it's, like, dress up the character to make them look as cool as possible. And then we have a contest to see whose character looks the coolest, because I've been saying it. I've been saying it since day one. Fashion is the end game. Uh, okay. So we can do... It's so ominous without music. Here's what we'll do. We'll do that, and then just hope. Yay. Love to see that. Okay, so that's our first enemy, but it doesn't matter. There are no seconds. There are no seconds at all. And you love to see that. I genuinely enjoy to see it. Uh, do- I mean, we could do this if we wanted to, but there's literally no penalty. I thought that was only on ones. You hate to see that. Anyways, go to sleep. As long as we click that button, we're very happy with uh, what we've got going on in our lives. Um, yeah, sure. This is a terrible... Listen, every time I click yes here, the important thing is that you should know that this is a bad idea. This is not worth it, like, 90% of the time, but it's fun. I am not a big fan 
of actually you know what I'm okay with this I like Ikumi Ikumi is cool she even has a blue option we're, we're just we're just Miku leveling you guys wouldn't understand it's a it's a complicated strategy oh what what mystery are we gonna use that on we will use it on I guess we could try to do coma yeah we, we, we can actually do coma with plus two damage I think we could do it with plus two damage and four bricks we could definitely do it and this is gonna be easy because we don't have to worry about uh, fighting a boss which is actually really nice. Uh, yeah, that's gonna do nothing, but there's no reason not to do it. Love to see Hermit. Absolutely love to see Hermit. Hermit, as you could say, is goaded with the sauce. I don't even know what that means, but I, I can't remember if it was like a Gianni video or a Luke video, but one of them said goaded with the sauce, so it can't be that bad, right? I think that's sort of my uh, my barometer of like if there's a haha funny internet word that I don't understand. Uh, yeah, sure, just Miku leveling. The, the, this is just the high tier strats, all right. Um, if there's like a haha funny internet word that I don't understand, love to see that. If uh, Luke or Gianni makes a, a shit post with it, it's probably fine. That's that's at least how I view it. I have I, that hasn't led me astray yet, but it could. It could, but I don't really know, like, the thing about internet parlance is that sometimes it's literally, like, a different language that doesn't make any sense. Like, what the hell does goaded with the sauce actually mean? Like, can, can anybody, like, I don't even know if I want it to be explained to me, because I, I'm trying to, let, let's try to figure it out together, alright? So typically, what I thought when people say the GOAT in modern parlance, that's supposed to be greatest of all time. So what does the ED mean? What, what, like, what, what is, like, what is goaded, like, goated? That doesn't make any sense. Like, why is it goaded with the sauce? Yeah, sure, why not? Who cares? Uh, like, why is it goaded with the sauce when it should be, well, I don't know what it should be. I'm not even gonna try to come up with something like that. But... Goated, okay, and with the sauce. Like, I, I don't even know what that could mean either. Like, people will ask for the the sauce on, like, Joey's shitpost status thumbnails, right? But it, it can't be that. Can it? it? It doesn't make any sense. Uh, anyways, we need to put... We'll, we'll we'll do it like uh let's see we we need to get so we're, we're gonna get plus two so i need to put one point to knowledge one point to dexterity and two points into charisma uh we could do the two points of charisma literally right now. That should that that's fine. Like it doesn't immediately benefit our combat, but we still have a couple of bricks and a branch. I'm not, uh, which is a a great uh, album cover, by the way. Also, this is ridiculous. But uh, anyways, what what are we doing? I don't know. Bulletin board, coma, ramen. Yeah, we'll do bulletin board now. The forest is doomed? Oh my god, I hate to see- you hate to see that. You absolutely hate to see that. Now, honestly, we could either run away here. I- I, I think we could. I, I think you definitely could run away here. Although, why would we when we can just do this? Because this will most like- like, we'll most likely be able to kill him. He flies closer, by the way. Can we do... hold on. We should be able to do this, even with our relatively slow attack speed. Yeah, I was definitely considering running away, though. I was thinking about it. I think it has its pros and cons. Uh, we should do this because it's a higher chance, and look at that. Well, actually, if we rolled a 4 on either one, it wouldn't matter because the other one's perception, but, you know, look who it is. Uh, yeah, we can do this. That's fine. Uh, dislocated shoulder? Excuse me? Minus one max stamina. Discard. Lose two reason. 
Have we gotten this before? I don't even remember this. We've probably gotten this like once. Okay, yeah, sure. That's so weird. Like, there's just things about this game that I'm like, hey, wait a minute, Midasu Touch doesn't work here, does it? Oh, it did. Okay, never mind. I was wrong. It did indeed work there. There's a spell that doesn't work there, and it trips me up every single time. Uh, yes. That is fine. Hate to see that, but, uh, you know, we're, we're just funding our uh, experimental treatment at the hospital. That's cool. Okay, the hospital is dangerous, by the way. I hate that. That's terrible. How dare you? You know, I was about to complain about 4% doom, but I really am not allowed to do that at this point. That would be very, uh... Uh... This is minus 2 stamina, right? Yeah, that's fine. Uh, yeah, we can do this. This is a little bit backwards to how I would probably like to do it, but that's fine. Sniffling Gardener. Probably get that looked at. You know, I just realized he's not human, he's a beast. This is like, uh, in Bloodborne. You, you hunt the beasts too much, you're eventually gonna become one. But uh, he do just be standing there, though, so maybe that's a little bit rude. Uh, our Brace for Impact is bad. We could kill him in one turn, though, actually. I mean, maybe. I can't say two 85% chances is a guarantee, but, like, you know. I think it's better than taking two stamina. We do get a weapon that we can throw, so that's cool. I mean, he's not standing there anymore, but, uh, you know, pre-meeting Miku and proceeding to be beaten to death by a flashlight, uh, he was indeed standing there. I, I really want to, like, assess the situation more often, just so that I can actually learn about what the hell is wrong with these enemies. Like, why is he a beast? Why is he a beast? He's just a dude. He's just a dude. Why is he a beast? Anyways, it doesn't really matter per se, but you know. Now let's not do this wrong. <laughs> let's, uh, let me actually try to do this correctly. Uh, I need an item, please. I would like an item. An item is a treat. So we've already spent so much doom getting this that it's not even really worth it. But we'll count it as nice for the 15 EXP. And I mean, listen, I'm gonna want more. I'm gonna want more bricks because, uh, you know, our combat is still awful. Although, you know, I'm not gonna lie, having seven in almost every stat is pretty cool. But uh, still, though, the fat rat doobie being grabbed, though, that's true. Oh, I don't know if we have enough money for this one. I, I, I don't know about that. Get one fund of drinks? Oof. A little rich for my blood. Yeah, sure, why not? It's risky, but if it's a, it's a nice risk to pay off because we would rather... Like, I mean, listen, we're opting into a lot of Doom here. I've opted into tons of Doom. But, you know... It's, like, fine, I guess. Okay, you can go to hell. This is a, I would say a runner, but we have 14 damage here that we can uh, play around with here. And she's done and or dusted. Now, if we could just not get into another fight, that would be great. We're probably going to forgore Hermit. Um, we, Like, this, this might be rude, but is it possible? Is it conceivably possible that we get a Miku perk? Like, I, like I, I know this is a little crazy, but is it conceivably possible? Also, this guy can also go to hell. Um, honestly, I think this is a run. Uh, actually, we can't run from this encounter, can we? No, we cannot. That's true. Okay. Also, I should have discarded the prayer beads instead of the, uh, uh, the brick. Definitely. Because the brick would have been very, very nice here. So we take 2%. 
or we can do this and then see where we're at. This is awful, by the way. Like, I hate this. You know what we're going to do? I'm doing this. I, I am genuinely doing that. That This is a gaming move. Just because I want to be out of this goddamn fight. This is 3-5. Okay, we're good. Uh, okay, hold on. Okay, that's 4. We're good. Like, 4% doom is nasty. Do not click the wrong button this time. Thank you. I was, like, watching for it like a hawk. Okay, is it... I, 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 I guess it's not possible. It's just not possible to get a, to get a Miku perk. Uh, I think we will not be able to get um, the ending ending A here. I, I don't think we can do it without adrenaline. I genuinely don't think we can. Like, I can try to get as much knowledge as possible, but it doesn't really, like, matter. I, I think not getting adrenaline is going to be a run killer. Like, the village is safe, so I'll go here twice just in case we, we feel like we can. But, uh, oh my god, we rolled exactly a 7. If this was a low threat level location, we would have just eaten it right there. Bro, how do I roll a natural 12 on a safe location? That's disgusting. That's genuinely terrible. Thank you very much. I will be taking that EXP immediately. Uh, like, it's possible that we could get, um... Oh, that's terrible. That's genuinely terrible, plus 4% doom. Hate to see that. Oh, let's go! You love to see Ewa just chilling. Let's get to the final investigation and then decide what it is that we're doing here. I think the best bet is probably just to use the monument as much as possible. That That's probably what we want to do. We could get Expel Evil from this. That could be nice. Or, or we could just get Midasu Touch again. That's that's also true. Uh, Six Perception, not a chance, actually. Not a chance. Okay, so 4-3. Let's go to the Monument. What do you want? You can have it. Uh, go to the Monument again. What do you want? Two Reason. Uh, do we have Fetid Fumes? Actually, no, we don't. We can do a little... There's no... We're not on Gazoo either. So we can do that. Go back to the monument. Ooh. Oh, I almost clicked that. That would have been bad. I would really love uh, Funds 3 or Stamina, th uh, stamina 4, Stamina 3, something like that. 82%, is that good enough? We go up to 85%. Oh, no, it's not, because we go up to 88%. That's bad. Yeah, no, that's rough. I actually hate that. Um. Yeah, so we go up to 88%. Do we have Branded or anything like that? I think we gotta use Hermit. We gotta figure out how to use Hermit here. So, if we go to the pharmacy... Alright, so first step is go to the pharmacy. Okay. Uh, Yoichi? Get out of here. Buy the experimental drug. And then hope that this does it for you. Oh, you hate to see that. That's possibly the worst thing that could happen. Okay, so we, we, we lived, quote-unquote lived. We have a light source, so it's not super bad. It, it's not, we're, we're not gonna die. Like, we'll, we will actually schmoove through the lighthouse effortlessly. The problem is the doom, which admittedly we don't have a uh, heart of darkness, but yeah, we just gotta go for it, honestly. Like there, there's nothing that we can do about it. We just kind of have to hope that we don't do him out. I don't think we will. 
It's definitely possible, maybe? This is gonna kill him, right? I mean, we'll throw our go-go gadgets just in case, because we already did the light source check, so it's fine. But, uh... Yeah, no, it's definitely a little sus, for sure. We possibly got one of the worst outcomes that we could have gotten, so if we win with the worst outcome, we're still very happy about that. Which, uh, listen, I'm up, I'm, I'm happy about that, alright? Can't say no. We did kick Takashi-san for 8 health. That's true. So anyways, thank you so much for watching. Uh, I hope you're all staying safe out there. Uh, I'm probably gonna go... I, like, I don't know what I'm gonna do, right? Because, like, I fell asleep before I recorded this. I woke up, was like, oh yeah, I need to do the World of Horror. I'll, I'll probably have to refresh the company actions uh, on Final Fantasy XIV, because I, I definitely did not do that today. Uh, so, sorry for all you Saturday gamers out there, but, uh, in my FC specifically. But yeah, uh, thank you so much for watching. Hope you're all staying safe out there. Have a good one. I'll see you on the next episode of World of Horror. Uh, the banter engine will hopefully be fully, uh, fully charged and ready to go on the next episode, but who knows? I don't know. Yeah, have a good one. Bye.